morning. This is Adam Smith with the Colorado Real Estate Finance Group on Monday, April 20. That actually means something here in Colorado. And of course, I would normally be here with your weekly zero cost marketing and contact management tip, but for those of you that have been paying attention, we've kind of changed that format a little bit due to what we're seeing in the real estate markets, and we've kind of been doing a what not to do tip uh, each week. We've actually been doing these realtor horror stories and some of the stories we've been getting have been amazing and we're going to share one with you each week including this week and of course give you guys all an opportunity to share yours and those of you who do will get an opportunity to win this week's prize but will talk more about that in a minute. And since I've gotten a lot of questions about it over the last few weeks, yes, we do still have a lot of classes going on, zero cost marketing, social media marketing, contact management, video blogging, and yes, we do also still have our mentoring program. There are about 50 of you coast to coast involved right now, mostly mortgage lenders, but certainly Certainly a good handful of realtors as well so if you want more information about any of that certainly feel free to reach out so let's talk about this week's horror story and this one just escapes me completely I can't even fathom why this would exist but I spoke with an agent on, well I spoke with a lot of agents on Friday but this one story in particular this individual is listing a property and it gets a multitude of offers, and that's just what's going on in the Denver market right now. But of all those offers, two of them were from the same potential buyer being represented by two separate real estate agents. Now, I don't even understand the motivation for that one. Now, I know it's highly competitive here, and we have escalation clauses and bidding wars, and reasonably priced properties are going to get dozens of offers, and half of them are going to have escalation clauses and so on. But the motivation to have two different real estate representatives and to submit two different, the offers weren't even identical, two different offers on the same property is escaping me. Maybe you guys can help us understand that one. Make some comments wherever you're getting this feed and let us know. Um, but that was uh, definitely an interesting story. Now, the reason that we're telling these stories, of course, that we're highlighting them, as you will, is because we want you guys to understand that we know those of you subscribing, you behave in the most professional, most ethical manner, but for those of you that are on the fringes, the agents that are seeing you behave this way are going to remember your name when the market isn't like this. And five years from now, ten years from now, who knows, you're going to be on the other side of the table and that agent is going to remember your name. So, please, refrain from making these stories, not that we don't love hearing them, and I suspect we're going to have them for a long time to come, but that's really kind of the tip behind what not to do here is, uh, remember, this is your career, not just a job, and what goes around comes around. All right, so let's talk about how to do this week's drawing. And again, we do want to hear these horror stories from all of you. These are really entertaining. We're having a lot of fun with them. So first, please, please subscribe here to our YouTube channel. Then at least you'll be notified of when we have these new horror stories coming out each week. And then second, make some comments down below. And we're certainly not limiting it to YouTube, although we would love you to subscribe. But if you're getting this feed via Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, or you're on the email subscription, certainly feel free to reply in any of those manners. And if we pick your story for next week's video blog, then we'll let you know and we'll get you out this week's prize. So, remember this week's non-tip. <laughs> Don't uh, let your clients have multiple agents, multiple offers, same property. I really don't even understand it. Hopefully you guys will be able to explain that to us.
Remember, make some comments, tell us your horror stories in order to win this week's prize. Have an amazing week, and we'll see you next time. Bye.